What is going on you guys? You know it is. This is your boy the Flight Mike and I'm coming at you guys with the recreation of my my GM mode. You guys did vote on the team you wanted me to use. A lot of people voted for the Los Angeles Lakers. I'm not going to lie. I automatically discounted those votes because there's like five Los Angeles Lakers my GM series going on right now. So at the end I chose the Chicago Bulls. I'm sure a lot of you guys will be satisfied with that because they have a superstar. They're almost at the championship cusp but they're not really fully there yet. They just need a little bit tweak and you know life would be good so I did simulate my first year and this video is pretty much gonna be a recap of that you can see the owner Wes MacArthur is very into winning he doesn't really care about much else except winning and attendance which you can't really blame him uh, you can see the fans are fairly interested so far and I'm not gonna lie you guys I'm not gonna approach this my GM like most other youtubers would approach their my GMs meaning I'm not gonna pretty much simulate my first year draft a crazy rookie or just go ahead and sign LeBron James in fact I actually am gonna go ahead and do the opposite of that and you're gonna see my philosophy once we get to the free agency section of this video so I didn't really get to set my budget you guys know of all of that but we're gonna go ahead show you my first trade I went away and tried traded Carlos Boozer for the expiring contract of Richard Jefferson and a first round pick and we're gonna just simulate to the offseason at this point you guys we did make it to the second round of the playoffs I simulated everything and you can see this is how my budget is pretty much gonna look like for next year for those of you guys who are concerned I really like showcasing every single part of my my GM mode and you can see right here this is probably my favorite part of the video when we get to the draft because look who gets drafted with the number one overall pick right over here With the first pick in the NBA draft, the Philadelphia 76ers select Julius Randle from the University of Kentucky. I agree with that selection for the number one overall pick. I decided to trade my first round pick because I felt like the Sixers were going to be a for sure lottery team next year, and I think it'll help. With the 31st pick in the NBA draft, the Chicago Bulls select Jordan Adams from UCLA. The 55th pick in the NBA draft, the Chicago Bulls select George Steele from Washington State University. I couldn't use post draft rosters because there's no create a player feature in this game. So we had to use pre draft rosters. But check out how I'm going about free agency. I went out, offered Pau Gasol a contract to be my starting power forward, and Mecca Okafor a contract to come off the bench as a solid role player, reuniting him with Ben Gordon, the former Chicago Bull. And my philosophy was instead of going out and breaking the bank on a superstar, let's go out and surround ourselves with. With good role players good pieces coming off the bench so we could have much more depth because that's what usually wins championships besides you know twin towers or having a crazy talented starting five plus jimmy butler is developing really well i didn't see a need to go get carmelo anthony or lebron james this is going to be my goals with my owner right now you guys for this year you can see he's not really happy after me simulating my first year but we could get that back up if you guys want more chicago bulls my gmo let me know in the comment section and be sure to leave a thumbs up i'm your boy the flight mike and i'm signing out Fuck.